All right, this one's going to be on Free Tux TV, although we're not going to install any of their software. However, they do have a GUI. I think it's built on top of um, VLC or something like that, but uh, we're not going to install any of that shit. Okay, uh, I already have three players. I have Impler, uh, MPV, and VLC, and that's really all I need. But um, we are going to use their their database they have like a database of different uh, channels for different languages so that's what we're going to use and we're just going to use VLC um, but more specifically a uh, NCURS version of VLC and we're just going to use our you know uh, terminal here to open it real quick so obey a bunch of functions and it's just called free tux TV here let's spell it right and they have different languages so you know whatever language you speak it doesn't have all the languages just uh, whatever they have on their database that's what I uh, did for these functions so let's go to English here and these are the channels um, and if you never used the uh, NCURS version of VLC this is what it looks like if you want to get more detail on it I'll post you a, a video in the description I talked about this a long time ago but uh, if you want to know how to use it properly then uh, you know watch that video but anyways these are the channels Let's go up and down with your arrow keys and let me show you something that does work here. So let's say Euro News here. I hit enter on that. And it should open the channel. Uh, you can do full screen, you can do you know volume up, volume down. Anything you can do with VLC, you can use uh, this to do that. So that's how you will watch the channel streaming over the internet. And it's free channels, okay. So let's go to another channel here. Let's say Euro Sports. And it should switch over. So this is Eurosport. So on and so forth. Let's turn on the volume here. The road. Both real. Alright, so there you go. You can hear the volume. Let me turn it down though. Anyways, um what else they got in here? We got a Russian TV and they have different uh, resolution here. So we go to 720p for this one here. And it should switch over to uh, Russian. What was it one? Russian Today TV or something like that. Yeah, there you go. Uh, my favorite one in this English category is uh, the Vivo one. I don't want to play because I don't want to get copyright. But uh, basically, it's kind of like uh, MTV or the Music Box channel. If if you watch that back in the '90s, they had like this Music Box channel. And they would just play music video after music videos. There was like no commercials at all or anything like that. And that's why I love that channel. So this is what this is, right? It's either MTV or the Music Box channel. And it just plays, um, you know, music videos. So I like that. However, I don't want to play it because I don't want to cop right here. But there you go. And this one is, what is this here? Twit? I think it's that Leo Laporte. Uh, I believe so. Yeah, it says twit here. So you can see his cockpits if you want to do that. All right. What else I got in here? I don't know, man. Let's say enter in some of this. Some of these channels don't work. I'll probably say majority of them don't work. So maybe 30% of these channels work or something like that. Right. But it doesn't work. It skips down to the next uh, channel until it stops or whatever. Uh, but we'll quit out of that. So I can do this for other, um, what is that here? Other languages too. So let's say for example, I think I checked out Spanish the other time because they had, uh, what channel did I watch in here? Let's go down to, what the hell? There you go, Discovery Channels, hit enter on that. And it should be playing, right? There you go, it's playing. Let's follow up here. So on and so forth, you get the idea. But that is how you would watch, uh, you know, just using straight up VLC from uh, your terminal here. So you don't have to install any software. Most people have VLC anyway, so if you have VLC, you can use it. All right. Anyways, how did I do this? Uh, really simple. I went on their site. What was their site? Free Tux TV. And this was their site. This is their online database of all the channels that people have submitted in. So you can actually submit in like a, a stream if 
you know, if you know of a good one that actually works or whatever, submit it to them and um, everyone can use it. I like that. Anyways, on the down here, this is where all the languages are. Okay. And I only did it for the web TV. I didn't do it for radio or webcam. Uh, I'm not going to bother with that. Uh, I only did it for the web TV, aka just, uh, you know, live uh, videos. But let's say, for example, this is English here. So we click on uh, this thing. And this is where the channels are. And I just copy this uh, M3U link, whatever. Copy that. And I open up my either Bash RC or ZSHRC, whatever you're using. Don't matter. But where the hell is that? Free Tux TV. There you go. Let me uh, move out of this. There you go. Right. And I just created an, a uh, function for this, right? And I just type in nvlc for the the nCurse uh, VLC, and then you paste in the URL. Pretty basic. That's all you gotta do, all right, uh, to set this up. Uh, I'll post you all this in the description if you don't want to waste your time and just copy and paste this. But uh, that is how I did it. And as far as the channels, like I said, it doesn't always work. Even though they say it is working on here, it says, look at it, look at all this status right here. It says working. Um, either their database is not up to date or some of the channels are offline at certain hours. So I don't know which is which, but um, not all the channels work, you know. But hey, it's free and you can try it out if uh, you don't have cable or you're one of those cable cutter or whatever. But uh, I like some of the channels in there, so I, I do watch it from time to time. Anyways, go check it out. Uh, real simple. That is it for this one.